Spitfire fridge, when it came to the shop, we ran it on test and it didn't freeze properly, so we assumed that it might have lost some of its gas. So we put a Schroeder valve onto the suction and we put a gauge on it and the system was running in a vacuum and um, when we unplugged the compressor the pressure would rise immediately and normally that would indicate that there's not enough gas in the system some of the gas had leaked out. Now we looked on the joints on the outside and we didn't see any visible leaks so there is a chance that there might be an internal gas leak and the only way we can tell whether there's internal gas leak because you can't see the tubes is we remove the suction from the compressor and the capillary tube we put a valve on here and we pump this up under pressure with a gauge. This gauge is marked in PSI and we've got it to about 340 PSI here, which is quite a high pressure. We've sealed this side off and we leave it for at least 12 hours. And if you come back in 12 hours time and this pressure is still the same, you can safely say that it's not leaking inside on the suction and it's got two internal condenser tubes, these two silver ones here. We can do exactly the same. We pump pressure up and see if it leaks. That's how I determine whether there's an internal gas leak or not. Thanks.